hello guys welcome back to innovative design tutorial so guys today we are going to create this 12 inch equality in solid work i hope you will enjoy our tutorial thanks for watching so let's see how we create this uh, 3d model of this 12 inch equality which are generally used in piping so if you have to create do go to the file select assembly okay now here we uh, just change uh, the background to plain white okay you have to just create so go to the solid work add-ins now select solid works routing here uh, we select the piping now we select start by drag and drop now we have to choose flange slip on build flange so simply select and drag to this uh, windows pop up ok here we will keep the flanges thin so rating and uh, size will be 12 inch NPS 12 now you have to save this uh, to your desktop and anywhere you want to save this uh, spool ok now Here uh, we have to just select pipe uh, properties, route, route properties. So here we select 12 inch and schedule we will keep it 40. Okay. Now here just go below side. Here we will select 90 degrees LR long radius 12 inch. Okay. So look uh, here the we are just started the this spool so simply select this point drag and now here we just uh, put slip on uh, weld flange to this end point so simply select drag to this point here we will keep also 300 rating NPS uh, uh, 12 inch okay so it's time to apply the T equality so simply select drag and uh, like this one you have to create equality 12 inch schedule we will keep 14 okay now here we just select this point and drag to reduce the length of this pipe okay so again we have to just uh, add the flange to top face so first we have to put the length of this uh, the distance between the T and the end face of this flange. So go to the smart dimension, select this face flange, select this point. Here we will keep uh, the length 350. Okay. Now again we have to just perform the same action to the opposite direction. So go to the smart dimension, select this face, this center point of this T. Here we will keep it 350 mm. Okay. So again, we have to just put the flange on top face. So first, uh, we have to just uh, put the flange. Then after we will uh, apply the dimension. So go to the flange, select the pound weld flange. Select this point. Here we will also keep 300 rating. Sizes will be 12 inch. Now again we select this line, this point and this face of this end face of this flange. Here we will keep it to the length 350 mm. Okay. So look how we apply the flange pipe T. Okay. So exit this sketch. Here we have to just uh, change the appearance, color, material. So go to the uh, material select make jeans. So this T and we will also select this pipe also. Okay. So guys, uh, we are just apply the uh, building 
to this uh, so go to the weld weld here we select weld path so simply select this one so we will keep it 10 radius fillet weld <coughs> sorry so if you want to see the weldment so go to the weld folder click right click and here we will show so cosmetic weld so it seems uh, much little uh, better so we have to just increase the fillet belt so again go to the assembly feature select belt width here we select weld part the fillet weld we will keep 15 mm now we have to just put the corner edge ok this one also so look here we apply the weld 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 fillet weld to this equality so again we have to just go to the weld weld and you have to apply the weld weld so go to the weld path and now here we just uh, keep this uh, one 20 ml now we have to select this back side of this plunge so we select this part of this bed vent like this one and top side plunge also ok so look guys how we apply the bed 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 vents and uh, flange piping routing in solid works so this video helps you more helpful for creating 3d model of pipe routing piping design and many more so if you like our video please subscribe our channel for more video and project thanks for watching